Get ready, get ready, get ready. Sexy vibes and hot vibrations. Interview with Ghetto Girl Blue. That's I N I N E R. Views. Vampire thing to life. Um. I. Hmm, <laughs> oh, we we feed off of each other, mm-hmm. and um. You're fine. We're gonna edit it. It's fine. <laughs> You're so cute. Oh my god. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> hey everybody. So this mm-hmm. is Annette and Chibi together. Mm-hmm. Hi. So wish the people happy Valentine's Day and invite them to come out and see you on the 18th. So Valentine's Day, do it. Be romantic. It's awesome. I'm super duper in love with this guy. And um, come see me seduce and turn him. And we're talking about feeding off each other, right? Yes. (laughs) So come out, see us have a good time, see other fantastic performers have a great time. Um, it's a variety show, so you're gonna get. There's something for you. You gotta mm-hmm. come see it. You gotta come and see it. Just trust me. Take me, baby. Take me.
was just laughing because speeding up of each other, like, ha, ah, but, <laughs> 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 but I'm going uh, home again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, oh. that's one example of our, uh, how we are, like, together, like, um, yeah, just... <laughs> <laughs> she made herself a uh, present by uh, liking some of my uh, photos and posts, so, you know, I had to <laughs> go to message her and say, uh -huh. hey. That's you know that's where we started off just in it off just talking to each other and you know getting opportunities to uh, meet each other in person uh -huh. and um, it started off um, we were able to meet back when um, when the, I had a performance with um, two of my crewmates and we were performing for um, Dizzy yeah the Dizzy Feet Foundation. The yeah, she still has a ticket. Well, so. Okay, so how long have you been dancing? I've been dancing since 2002. Um, I've actually learned about um, popping back uh, when I was in high school. Mm -hmm. And I was a sophomore and also um, just moved from Germany. So I was invited to a... Uh, uh, party and uh, while I was there I noticed this guy doing some like some moves and when I asked like what was he doing he was he uh, he gave he gave me the term pop and lock mm -hmm. which um I guess that's like kind of the usual term like you know pop and lock or break dancing that was when I really got into popping and uh, then I saw like the um the style I'm specialized in uh, robot and I know, like, I've seen, um, you know, people, like, at clubs, like, trying to do the robot, and it's kind of the, the like, the broken arm, or something <laughs> like that, but um, I've actually, like, once I saw people actually do professionally, like, actually look like robots, I mean, that really caught my eye, and I wanted to really learn more of the style, and then try to expand from there. Um, so I saw something you did that was like really slow motion. <laughs> when, when I think of animation, I think of um, a term like anime to like make um, to make um, alive, um, to bring to life. So, like I think of like what would it look like if a like either like a robot or a doll, a puppet, like comes to life? How would they move? And um, and like they could have like kind of human like movements but they're not human so it'll it you kind of make create the illusion of like like the frames like really skip yes and um like they have like a like it has like a direction of how they want to move but you can tell like they're not real because like their smoothness is not right not there mm -hmm. so animation like one one way of animation is like trying to imitate those movements so it's the look of like um like trying like skipping frames while like move like moving like uh normally so do you have any dance influences people that you like um as far as dance influences um robert shields mm -hmm. um who's like part of a uh, shields in the arm, uh, so they were um they were a du um uh, a duo, um actually husband and wife. Le jeu de l'émotion, de l'extase et de la passion. 